You're probably saying to yourself, another championship collection baseball box, Darren? Yeah, but this one's old. It's different than my regular championship collection boxes, and there won't be any black boxes of wonder in here. But this is really cool. I got two of these off of eBay. Oh, look at my dice. Box cars. That's for good luck. Um, you can't even see these things. They're so big. They're freaking huge. Anyways, I got two of them off of uh, the old eBay. I got them shipped, taxes, and everything for 70 So $35 a piece, 12, 12 packs in each. And uh, I know it probably ain't going to be monetarily worth it. But you never know. There's a couple packs in here that say hobby on them for some reason or another. We got a Bowman draft there. It's going to be fun. Did I keep the right one up top here that I took a picture of? Shit, I don't know. It doesn't matter. Um, let's open this one. All right. It's funny. These were on eBay and, and uh, these two. And, and then... Um, they got bid up to like 80 or something, and they must not have sold because they got relisted. And uh, they must not have got paid for. And then uh, I bid on them again. I didn't want to pay like 80 bucks, you know, before shipping and taxes. So I bid, and I got them for 70 shipped and taxes. Here's my free collector's package. $55 value from Beckett. Do you think they'll still take it? Probably not. I'm joking. They won't take it. Uh, what's the expiration date on this? That might give me an idea of... Uh, offer expires June 1st, 2005. So I bet these came out, you know, late 2004, early 2005 or something like that. Um, I know these are probably glued, so that's going to kind of suck. Uh, yeah, they're coming off okay. Trying hard not to... You know, bend the cards. Um, you guys can fast forward a little bit if you feel like it while I'm attempting to not damage the cards within. What do we got here? Here's our 2004 Bowman Draft. I don't think that's a huge year for... First Bowman cards. Still fun. I think there's a lot of 2002 in here. That's uh, Joe Maurer's rookie year. It'd be fun to get my hometown boy, Hall of Famer Joe Maurer rookie card. This is some high quality content right here. I'm trying to rip packs off, but I think they're coming off okay. I'm not really, I don't think I'm bending the cards significantly at all. This pack is gonna rip. So much for reselling that pack on the old eBay's. Put this back here, huh? It's a uh, 12 packs inside, blah, blah, blah. Originally sold for $9.99. Um, all right, let's see what we got here. Um, Legends, 2004. All right, and Power Up, I think that was kind of a low-end set. 2004. This is supposedly a hobby pack, Upper Deck Vintage, 2004. Uh, Upper Deck Series 2 uh, retail pack. I think that's a halfway decent pack. This was a pretty low end, I think. Donruss Fan Club, although it's got short printed rookies. 60 top prospects. Um, Donruss 2002. Uh, trying to kind of somewhat rank them here. Find game use cards, 1 in 12 packs on average. That's also a hobby. And a draft picks car uh, pack. What's this one? Series 1, Cooperstown Tribute Gold, 1 in 24 packs. Clear Tradition, MLB, 2005. Kind of like that pack. We got a 2003 Topps card. I wonder how it's... Oh, yeah, these are bricked. So, 
this is like a, yeah, a dollar pack power up. Let's see if any more, uh, these are bricked. Yeah, those are bricked. No, I don't think so. Probably not. I don't think so. Uh, no. So, uh, let's open this brick pack first. All right, 2003, Series 2, was it? Yeah, there, no, silly boy. Yeah, Series 2. Actually, they don't seem terribly bricked. I don't see any paper loss. Wade Miller, Ray Ardonez, Jose Vidro, uh, Todd Ritchie. Uh, we got a Randy Wynn. wonder if you got the win. Matt Stairs, and uh, one of these uh, advertisements, decoys, Joe Creedy, and we got a Jay Payton. All right, another advertisement. All right, this pack looks lame. Series 1, 2004, dollar pack. I wonder if these are like Dollar Tree or something at the time. Um, but actually, there's good rookies in here, aren't there? Isn't Yadier Molina in here? I don't know if he was Series 1 or Series 2. Carlos Guillen, Ishii, Frank Thomas, Sporting News insert. Uh, World Series uh, 100th Anniversary uh, insert. And uh, we got a first year of Rodney Choi Fu. And John Knott, first year card. This was back when they actually had prospect draft pick cards still and top space set. All right, let's go to some of these. Uh, let's go to these power up 2004. All right, Cliff Floyd, uh, Tim Hudson, Alfonso Soriano, Shami Shosha, uh, Phil Nevin. Rafael for call. Orlando Cabrera. Now, is that probably a parallel of some sort? It's Alex Rodriguez. Um, it's got 100 down there. I think you put the code in and you power something up, play some kind of online game or something. Um, and we got a Shining Through Cliff Floyd insert. And this probably describes the uh, power up game. Power up your points. Anyways, yeah, I collect a nine-player team, blah, blah, blah. You guys can read that on your own if you want. All right, here's another power-up pack. So I guess Alex Rodriguez and the other guy aren't going to be able to buy the Timberwolves unless they win in court. Glenn Taylor, I think, decided, oh, man, the Timberwolves are really good this year. I want to keep the team. I'll look for any technical reason I can to tell them they can't buy the team anymore. Jay Gibbons, Hank Blaylock, Larry Walker, Garrett Anderson, Bartolo Colon, Big Sexy, Tony Batista, Carlos Delgato, Hideo Nomo, and what we got for our insert, Kurt Schilling. Where's his bloody sock? So we didn't get a parallel on that one, so maybe those are a little bit harder to hit. Um, and what we got, Downers Fan Club. Let's get one of those short printed rookies they talk about on the front of the pack. What year is this? 2002. And let's make it a Joe Maurer. All right. Uh, Mark Quinn. Mark McGuire. Big Mac. It's a nice card. Larry Walker. Fan club favorites. Tony Gwynn. Insert. Shane Reynolds. Jeff Bagwell. Aramis Ramirez. And what we got here? Donruss 2002. That was another bricked one, wasn't it? Maybe it's not as bricked as it feels. I don't know. We'll find out. Uh, I think we got a Barry Bonds on the back there. Let's see if I can get him off. Yeah, he... <laughs> get him off the back of the pack. Um, Donruss 2002. Barry Bonds. And there's a uh, Ken Griffey Jr. right behind him. We got some some big names here. And what we got here? 
uh, Siyoshi Nin Shinjo, Shinjo, traded to San Francisco. Advertisement, got a nice decoy there. And we got a Pat Burrell and a Jeff Jenkins. Well, we got a couple of big name players. This is Tops. Series 1, 2003. And these are feeling pretty bricked. And we got Paper Loss. Pat Burrell, Herbert Perry. All right. Herbert Perry, Joe Torre, Ugith Urbina, Ruben Sierra, David Justice. And we got some league leaders here. And there's uh, Rolando Orojo, Bobby Higginson, John Flaherty, Ramon Ortiz, and Carlos Guillen. Well, that pack's garbage. Um, I think I ended up flipping these around the other way. So we're going to go in... Whatever. These are all good packs we got left. This is Upper Deck. Um, 2004 Series 1. Find game use cards. 1 in 12 packs. Uh, Eric Gagne. Derek Lowe. Craig Wilson. Larry Walker. Royce Clayton. Here's a National Pride. Steven. Steven Head. Yep, Steven Head. The old Stephen Head. The famous Stephen Head. Well, at least I can say I got head tonight. Um, Josh Hall, Star Rookies. And Trot Nixon. All right, let's see what's in this 2004 Bowman Draft Picks pack. All right. Nathan Phillips, first year card. Mike Wood. So I got head and a wood. Um, probably the wood first. <laughs> oh God, I gotta shut up. Kids show Darren, Joe Kashansky, Richie Robnett, and who we got here? That's a Zach Granke. That's a gold, the thick gold parallel card. And this is a like second or third year maybe. I think his rookie he has like a first year card in two thousand two. So this is pretty cool. I wonder if he fits in a regular top holder. It's a nice veteran card. Early Zach Grinke should be a Hall of Famer. Jeff Francis and Wes Whistler. All right. Clear Tradition. MLB. 2005. So Justin Verlander would be fun in here. Oh, good. These won't be bricked. They're old school type. Uh, Roger Clemens, The Rocket. Mariano Rivera. That's a nice card. Doug Davis. Uh, Roy Oswalt. David De Jesus. Kelvin, Kelvin Escobar. Diamond Tributes. Yvonne Rodriguez. That's got red foil and it's an insert. Just don't know how good or rare it is, but I like it. I couldn't research every one of these sets. I'm just winging it. There's a decoy. Lance Berkman, Mark Redman, and Tyke Redman. Tyke Redman, the old Tyke Redman. All right, these claim to be hobby packs. I think yeah, this one said hobby on it somewhere. I don't know, maybe not. Oh yeah, I remember these cards. Uh, Randy. Hundley, Randy Hudley, 19 something, 19 for 1969, uh, 1986. This must be like when they had MVPs or something. 1976, we got, uh, who's that guy? George Foster, 
Anyway, I totally recognized him. But Mike Schmidt, 1980. And Gary Carter, 1988. Rest in peace. All right, last pack. Matt Mante. This is from the uh, Upper Deck Vintage set. Aubrey Huff, Ray Durham, Jake Peavy, another decoy. Jerome Williams, Bernie Williams, and Randy Johnson. All right. Well, that was fun. Um, you know, generally probably not my money's worth, but uh, it's not all about that. It was fun. We got some cool cards. You know, your Randy Johnson, that insert of Ivan Rodriguez, that Zach Greinke gold parallel. Second or third year card for him. Nice Ken Griffey Jr. and a Barry Bonds. We got this parallel Alex Rodriguez. Uh, worth 100 points in the online game. And, uh, yeah, some other cool cards here and there. So, thanks for watching. Give me a subscribe. Subscribe if you like this, because I'll have another one of these. I'll probably wait. I'll probably wait a week or two to open this one. Because um, this was already a 16-minute video. Yeah, thanks again for watching. Bye.